Head of the Guyana Office for Investment, Dr. Peter Ramsroop, believes that the country's scope for development is unlimited and oil service providers should bank on the opportunity to grow their companies here. While delivering remarks during the opening ceremony for an oil field service company at Plantation Room, East Bank de Marara, he suggested that companies build the parts they use rather than shipping equipment from their overseas-based headquarters. He says such a response adds value to Guyana's growing economy. We don't want to just sell this material to Exxon. We want to produce it in Guyana. We may never build an FPSO, but we will build major components of the FPSO in the future. So we're looking for the transition. We welcome investors today and what they bring to the table. But tomorrow, investor, we are looking for much more. Dr. Ramsroop said the government of Guyana is looking for ways to add value to raw materials produced locally. He also encouraged more collaboration between local and foreign companies. We welcome our foreign direct investors. We appreciate the fact that they are working with local providers to um, provide expertise and capacity and capability. And that is the true intent of our Investment Act, is to ensure that all of our investors in country understands that we are open for, for business. Minister of Natural Resources Vikram Bharat has also urged investors to manufacture using local products to boost the country's economy while maintaining the country's resources. The authorities here also want to lower the exorbitant cost of energy and gradually divorce itself from using harmful fossil fuels. As such, the highly anticipated mega gas to energy at Wales on the East Bank de Marara is underway. The project is expected to significantly lower manufacturing costs. It is expected to be completed in 2024. Reporting for the newsroom, I am Lozina Yearwood.